all praise to the Most High and only the Most High. Family, I know I've been away for a few weeks, but I'm back. The Most High has been dealing with me with a series of dreams that I've been taking down and doing numbers on. This one was a shattered iPhone. I dropped it and shattered the screen in a dream I had. This is what it's talking about. The most I revealed to me. Decoding my ID. It's not my ID. It's Yahweh's. Hitting opponents. Babylonian. Trashed charter. These are the codes. Let me start with this trash charter. This charter was an airplane that the professional team was on after a playoff loss. They trashed the airplane called a charter plane. It really has no meaning, but once I looked up the word charter, it was talking about the internet. Somebody getting away. Two months of free internet. And this is what the iPhone is about. This, this is about communication. What you are communicating with in these last times. Who you have soul ties with. We're getting down to it, people. Time is almost up. So let's see what's going on. You're hitting opponents. Also vibe with that trash charter was a gate agent. What did this gate agent do? Well, she delayed the flight. Or it could have been a he, but I know this gate agent delayed the flight for three hours. But he couldn't leave. So she had some type of control. Or this whoever it was, he or she had control. Now, gatekeepers. Exposed. Agents of YouTube, Yahweh, God, angel worship, keep going back to these same things, people, murder, kill. So according to their scripted books, Exodus 15, 3, this angel in the Old Testament is the Lord of war. And in 1 Samuel 15, 3, he instructs to kill both men and women, infant and suckling, ox and sheep, camel and ass. That's not the most high. That's their God and angel they worship, Yahweh. So you call on God, you still call on an angel, which in the end, it's Yahweh. There is no way around the most high. Anything else is angel worshiping and you are serving Yahweh. If you continue with the soul ties you have with them, then you are communicating with angels too. Communication. Skype. Lip or ring. This is another code. When you see it in yellow, the codes. So what are we talking about here? That ID. Decoding my their ID. Well, you're hitting the poems. You're about to find all this out. You know your hidden opponents are the gatekeepers of YouTube, agents of YouTube, who is secretly trying to murder and kill you. But communication, Skype, liquor ring, it vibe with ID, wireless. Broken communication. See, they've been exposed. This is what the shattered iPhone meant. Their beast system, which is Yahweh based, has been exposed, people. Yuri Yasharel, why did he vibe? Because of Skype. He had a platform called Skype. But it wasn't his platform. He was just trying to put together some people. Looking for the true ones to deceive and take out to the wilderness. You know, your wilderness doctrine, people, is you are perfect set up to be murdered and killed, eaten alive, wake up. 
Then you have wrap the news. And so you can't make this up. Deceive with transgender photo. Lie about mother. You know, I don't watch him anymore, but um, someone told me to go pay attention. So I looked at him, and I see he's still at it. You know, he says he's put a picture out there, a photo, to flush out some people. Why lie about it? The most high people don't lie to deceive. That is straight up manipulation and deception. And if you're still subscribing and paying attention to this character, you're in trouble. You're being deceived. See, you can't make this up. Hm. I had this dream before he even put this here. Change in the photo about his mother and come back and lie about it. Why lie? It's Sean Whitehead. These are nothing but Nephilims, beast of the field, ring of deceivers. See, everything in this first set of codes is about exposure. They like to call on God. Well, God is Yahweh. And now that vibration has been exposed. Edgar Mendez said it best. They are YouTube agents that have been exposed. They tried to hide behind Babylon. But that has been exposed. Freemasonry, hand signs, covering of one eye, all has been exposed. They've been keeping you thinking on a lower vibration and frequency. This is what liquor ring is about. To ration you out a little truth with a lot of deception. They use code words to keep the spell enchantments, incantations, and magic to keep you dumb down. Yahweh B. System and his agents have been exposed. The Most High has begun the unveiling. It is not up to the true real human humans to seek the Most High and the truth that is on the inside of them. And then eternally, soulless, I am already dead. Ashtar Sharan, God. What does this mean? Extraterrestrial communication. Necromancy. Leviticus 19.31 reads, Their books, regard not them that have familiar spirits, neither seek out the wizards to be defiled by them. Deuteronomy 18.11 Or a charmer, or a consultor with familiar spirits, or a wizard, or a necromancer. These people are dead. They are soulless beings. Look, they offer to necromancy and conjuring of the dead. And you see that all through the world, through their books, their scripted books. Just hadn't paid attention enough. Listen to what they're saying, people. I'm going to keep going back to this. Listen to what they are saying. They're full of lies and manipulations and enchantments to keep you dumbed down. Sorceries, black magic, turbans, do-rags, shades. They use this stuff against you, people. Pay attention. And then I saw Elvis Presley. King of the world, enjoy the show. We made our choices. First Samuel chapter 8, verses 11 through 19 talks about kings being placed over you and take everything you have because you are in covenant with the YouTube agents who serve God, Lord, which is Yahweh. They are the kings of the world, which is Yahweh's B system. You know, they have been strategically placed in different places in their B system. The school system, educational system, church, religion, they call themselves pastors, politics, government. They're everywhere, people. 
strategic place there to keep the real humans down there. Hmm. To enjoy the show, you must pay attention. You cannot have any dealings with these characters, actors, hypocrites who are out here on this world stage playing a role. This is what enjoying the show is. The characters and actors, people. And their job and their role is to keep you dumbed down. Keep you from turning back to the most high and keeping his instructions and commandments. They are soulless. Already dead. Twice dead. And now they are just around here. Nephilims. Soulless beings. Posing as him. Why? Because of the choices they have made. And they communicate and serve extraterrestrial angels, their God, Yahweh. See, the rabbit hole doesn't run deep anymore, people. We keep telling you this. They have been exposed. Once you understand that this system is about angel worship and about Nephilim, who are the kings that are running this system, you got it then. Curse of Baphomet. Word God decodes God. Lord of Israel, <laughs> who is Yahweh. Yahweh is the curse of the Baphomet. They all must sell their soul to this tranny angel who has breasts and a penis with children looking up to it. <laughs> That's creepy. That's wicked. This is how Yahweh's system works. See, Rap the Nuth had to put a picture of a tranny on his page to deceive the real human. Their assignment is to continually deceive you until the end. They can't do anything right. They've been liars from the beginning, according to their scripted books. And they're going to keep lying to you. Some of them, are in, they are in too deep. They can't turn. They didn't understand or know the consequences that came. Selling your soul. <laughs> the Akashic, Akashic Records. What's the this vibe with? Channeling. Medium. This code is about non physical vibration that contains every thought, emotion, and experience that has ever happened to every soul that has ever existed. It has been compiled to a handbook. You see that? Once again, handbook. Your books are corrupted. All books are. You must have the wisdom and the knowledge and understand the revelation from the Most High to go into these books and understand the true vibration that's in them. I always say that the Most High has given His people the ability to go off into their scripted books. For one, to understand and learn your enemy tactic, how they work. That is what has been keeping you dumbed down for hundreds of years. This is nothing but witchcraft, sorcery, and magic once again placed in a book. So this 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 shadow iPhone with the most high has shown me is about communication. How their communication is now broken. They have been exposed. On every platform of the world, the Most High is exposing, unveiling, and bringing it down bit by bit. Babylon is through. It is crumbling. It is crumbling. Look, the truth is a vibration here in these end times. We keep telling you that the truth is on the inside of you. It's the Most High instruction. Don't need a book, people. You've been studying books for the longest. What, what has it done for you? Does it pay your bills? No. You get up off your ass, you go to work, make the money, and pay your bills. It's as simple as that, whatever it may be. Now, where you just don't have the ability to overcome some things, that's when the Most High gets involved. The Most High will take care of his people. The true one. 
a true human. So they are running around their platform scheme. It is over. It is over. Just pay attention to what they're telling you, people. Go back and do your own study and research. Continue to listen to the true human, surf the creator, Edgar Mendix. Pay attention to the sword of that weed and those little banners that he have up there. They mean so much. Pay attention. These are the end time. Time is running out. See, the most high is not about grace. I've told you once, grace is an angel. Grace is about death. The most high is about giving his people time to figure it out. But you got to turn back to the most high and ask him for instruction. Keep the instruction. And leave this meat alone. All this is about the Shabbat. I got another lesson coming up about somebody that said they exposed me in Jamatria. It's going to talk about the Ten Commandments being the Ten Kings. It's coming up. You see, they worship the book, the cube. We don't. We worship. We don't worship. We just keep the instruction that's on the inside of us. You know when you do wrong. You commit fornication. You know it. Adultery. You know if you lie, you steal, you kill. You know this. It is on the inside of you. They have spent trillions of dollars having us buying books after books after books. Going all into the world looking for the truth. And all the time, you've been carrying the truth with you. So they are exposed now. The rabbit hole doesn't run deep. At this point, you should know that, hey, if it's outside of those commandments and instructions that are going inside of me, then it's bullshit. It's bullshit. Turn totally back to the Most High. Keep those instructions and commandments, and you will be protected here down the stretch. All praise to the Most High. And only the Most High. No one else. Be blessed, family. Be blessed.